Alright, let's do some more Animal Crossing if you're watching this later on YouTube. Thanks for clicking, hope you've been enjoying so far. It is actually daytime, I haven't changed the clock or anything. Um, the bug off thing is on, so I figured, ah, let's do some daytime stuff now. I feel like these load screens take ages sometimes. I don't think I've ever actually done the bug off, so... There's a bit of time for it. Oh, the music is different as well. well. I don't even know what the event actually is. Oh, this is like an, this is an extra flower here. Can't have that. My stupid joke. Ah, <laughs> uh, dear. Let's get the daily stuff out of the way. More blue. This is red. Which... I mean, the more blue I get, the better. Oh, cool. Alright, that's done. My bad, my bad, my bad. Hybrid red, I guess. I still haven't had much luck in that department. Okay. I'm just gonna operate the ones that I don't really want.
I'll go get a new one. I can't do either of them. <laughs> I can't actually craft either of those two items. Oh cool, another bubble machine. Then go mirror the other side of it. Double. I don't think I'm going to buy any of that. it here. Wait. I'm just glad I'm getting more of these flowers. No luck here. Wait, what color is that? Yellow? That's yellow. Okay, I need more yellow, so sure. Nice, another gold. probably just lift this and go place it where I want it to.
think the way I'm gonna do it. Hang on. So I'll have the extremely rare ones. And then just do this. There we go. Oh, that's the wrong one. There we go. Nearly there. Gay rack, eh. <laughs> so wait, where is this last one? Oh, here it is. I think I have a lot of stuff. I just <laughs> noticed it's loaded in one by one. Come on, blathers. is one. Whoa. 
Sure, I'll probably do that later. I guess let's just set stuff up. Get rid of all the junk. Keep that. Okay. Oh wait, I missed the fossil. Oh no, I didn't. I missed a rose. I'm mistaken. stuff out and visit halves. I don't know if this was a legit one, we'll see. Easter table. See if I can customize the fish container thing. Mm. 
Oh, hold on. The statue. Let's find out if it's legit or not. Either way, I was going to buy it. Ah, uh, it's such a dumb joke, but it makes me smile. I've bought this painting so many times. That statue's all flipped so many times. I'm going about whether bugs are friends or bait <laughs> on there. Okay, well we're paying the thing grand. I kind of wish there was more variety with the item that she gives you. I'm 
I guess that's the only one that would fit in. Well, hang on, did it change the flavors? No, flavors are the same. Fish container. I haven't really used much yellow, so... that menu. Get rid of all the other stuff. Okay, I, I didn't put them in storage, I cancelled. I think there's one more storage expansion. Because I vaguely recall that the storage limit was like 3,000. I don't know. Let's go have a look. Get to the event in a minute. Just want to check up on something. Hi. 
You have more storage in your home now. Yes, that's perfect for storing all sorts of furniture and things. I think we can expand your... Yeah, okay. Yeah, fine. How much is it though? I mean, I, I'll probably wait. I'm gonna do turnips one more time. With that being said, I could probably customize the look of it. The storage limit is 5,000. Okay. I'll wait. I'll do turn up some more time. I gotta get something that looks like a venue. Oh, right, I can change the mailbox as well. Uh, I mean... I guess I should go with, like... Though this is more of a public mailbox, it's not a private one. At least in Australia, that's what they look like. They're red and yellow. I think I'll just go with that. It's fine. Alright. I'm gonna go place the stuff that I got now. Uh, I was gonna try and put a darts board in here. Hang on. Hopefully it fits and doesn't cause problems, let's see. Yeah, it's fine. I can squeeze here. The uh, I mean, realistically, <laughs> it should be more clearance behind it, but let's just ignore that. Uh, what else did I got? Okay. Around for a sec. There we go. Good enough. I think that looks better. What else have I got? Uh, Alright, that goes downstairs, and I think that goes downstairs potentially as well. Maybe upstairs. I'll see how much room I have.
Alright. I mean, I guess ideally the way this would work would be I'd take away one of these and do this. And it's fine, it, as long as I can get behind the counter. Ah, that works. I wonder if I have anything else I can hang there now. Probably place one up here as well. I think it would suit it. Ah, uh, what else have I got? Fish container, table, pal. Alright, that's all outside. For the towels, I was gonna do them down the right side. Like this was going to be the beach area, so in spirit of that. <laughs> Damn it, turned away. Excuse me. I mean, I should be able to squeeze like three here. Maybe four. Just do that for now. I'm not really going to do much with this part of the beach. I think just leave it as a beach. Put some towels, maybe a sandcastle. That's about it. I don't think I need to complicate it. Because everything else is... I wouldn't say cluttered, but it's just full of stuff. Oh, and thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. I think I have this. No? I may have found the skull one. Okay, well... Wait, can I squeeze behind here? I might have to... Hold on. Just adds a little more to it. Don't think I need to do anything beyond that. It's just a background element. Probably get away with the second one. Mm -hmm. 
I'll see what chairs I have. I might have to order some. These will do, I think. Maybe. I don't really have anything else I could use. Maybe these, but... Eh. Oh, wait a minute. I think I remember something about the bistro table. I think the chairs don't perfectly align with that if you're just using two. Let's see. Kind of sit in a weird position. Hmm. I think they have to go this way. Like they're intended to be vertical. So I'll probably have to modify this ever so slightly. Okay, uh... Do I do this now? I'll do this now. Whoops. <laughs> I'll fix that. Try this now. I think it might even have to go one bigger than this. Hmm. 
I mean, maybe it's fine. I don't know. I could probably squeeze another one in. Check if I have that one. I forgot to change clothes, I need to change clothes. Just so thumbnail later is different. Oh damn, I can get like the full Santa outfit now. Be boots, yeah. Right, I bought it all. Too early to wear the whole thing. I'm gonna find out what this is, because I have never done this before. Hey, it's showtime for the December bug off. Are you excited? Of course you are. Feel it, right? That electricity today? The wall is in the between this world and the infested realms? The rules for the bug off are simple. Each round, you catch as many can bugs as you can in three minutes. You give you points depending on how many bugs you catch. Collect points and you can redeem for sacred bug related relics. During the bug off, bugs you catch are miraculously transubstantialized to the bug cage. Okay. Alright, so like, an easy way to cheat this is hit trees. Get the wasps.
please get out of the way. I'm gonna need a hybrid plow, this is probably a good bet. Sucks at the time it doesn't stop when the animation goes off. wasps. Seven. What? Oh, there's like one per season. I didn't get the spring one. Oops. Lots here. I'm going to beat. I'm going to beat it this time. Nice. Wow. Killing it.
Nice. This one glitched. Damn it, it moved. I right, don't bother with that one. Got it. I'll be lucky if I get another one. Another balloon? By the ball. Something else? Redeem points? So you're redeeming 10 points for a bug relic. The bug cage. Ladybug umbrella. Hmm. Oh. It's kind of neat. So what else I can get? I like how much easier this is compared to the fishing one. Ugh, that's a distraction.
more. anymore. This round did not go as well. I don't think I'll even reach double digits here. Yeah. Oh, I might now. Suddenly my numbers just jumped. again. It's good money making. It's a backpack? Butterfly backpack. <laughs> I guess. All is above here. Instantly. Didn't want to swing early. I can bait 11, I'll be happy. Too late. Okay, there's multiple here. Yeah. Damn it. I just missed.
Bob if I can get it. Got it. I saw a shadow, but I don't know where it went. Oh, damn, those ones there, I couldn't see it. Butterflies. Yep. One more. Come on. One more. It's okay. Still counts. Nice. Alright, record beaten. Alright. Uh, what are you gonna give me this time? Hey, Star. Yeah, I'm on early. A little bit earlier. Just had breakfast with my brother, caught up for a bit, and then I got nothing else to do today, so I figured I'd check this out. I haven't done this event before. How's things? Termite mound? I guess if I want to do natural decorations. Spider door plate. <laughs> well, we don't want that. What does this look like? Whoa! That's... didn't expect it to be that big. Why would I want that? You met a new dog and hoped she'd get along with your dog and he could have a new doggy friend. Fortunately, it didn't go too well. No new doggo. Ah, that's unfortunate. Yeah, that's basically a coin toss. I only went out for a bit. <laughs> I really wanted to get home quickly, because there's just people everywhere at the moment. This is not a good start, I haven't seen a bug yet. It's not driving home to queue. Almost two hours to go 30 miles, jeez. Oh, this is... this is bad. I finished the, the bear story yesterday, so the bear was actually a bear. 
But the whole story is that old guy that saved us, he also escaped out of jail like 20 years prior. And pretty much what happened, someone rescued him. And the guy, it was, it was just plot twist after plot twist, but you find out, oh, he was rescued. And that he took the guy's identity, so you're like, why did he take the guy's identity? And then it gets revealed that the reason he went to jail was because he was a hired assassin. And he was hired to kill the guy that saved him eventually. But he didn't have the heart to do it because he got taught not to, uh, not to just kill for no reason. Like, the community taught him that there's a difference between hunting and slaughter. So, when it came time to pull the trigger, he didn't, and the big bear killed the guy he was supposed to kill. So the guy told him, hey, keep living and atone for the both of us. So that's why he took an interest in Saijima, because Saijima was effectively him. But it was interesting. I really enjoyed the plot. And then we head to the city and it was just insanity. <laughs> I dressed up as Santa and had to break up a gang of teenagers that were assaulting other Santa Claus. And I got ambushed by children who wanted presents. It's the game in a, it's the game in a nutshell. <laughs> You have a very serious story, and then the next minute you're Santa, and you're hitting teenagers with bicycles. Uh, that's why. That's what I like about the game. It's just. It's almost like you're watching a movie, and then in between the serious tone, it just has stuff that is just absurd. I came across a dude that had slipped and fallen in the ice. So you see him and he, he's, uh, he's like yelling at you to come help him. So you go see what's up and he tells you, wait, stop. Before you cross the street, it's icy. So you have to try and cross the street and not slip. So you get to the guy and he's a delivery driver. Who's delivering a massive bowl of ramen to some dude standing at the end of the road. And he's like, I can't deliver this, deliver this for me. So you, you start carrying the bowl of ramen, moving slowly. And then suddenly these people come sliding down the street on their asses. Because they've slipped and fallen and are moving at like 30 miles an hour. On the sidewalk. If what I described is just, it just sounds made up, I, I promise you it's not. It's just... You watch a serious story and then and that happens. And I played the... The Mario 64 snow music. So that just made it even better. Now you want ramen again? Was it too late to get some? It, it was a pretty massive bowl. It looked good. Can't get any? Ah, oh, that's a shame. Yeah, if you had watched last night, it was pretty bad. There was the ramen side quest, and then there was a side quest where we met this girl who was looking to get lamb barbecue. Barbecue. 
that was the quest. We take her to the place, she invites us to eat, and she eats way more than anyone. But they just keep eating the lamb barbecue. <laughs> I definitely think if, if you're a fan of, like, just what you've been seeing, you should try, try the games. Particularly Zero. But this one's pretty good. I, I think the weird side stories are, uh... Probably as good as the ones in Zero. Yeah, the bug off is you just catch as many bugs as you can in three minutes, and you get points, and then you can redeem the points for, like, prizes, so... And I think at the end of the day, someone's a winner, and you get a trophy if you get it. I think 13's my best. Is that doll filming a movie? Okay, like, there's two ways we can approach the explanation for this. I can say nothing, and you come up with your own story, or I can tell you the stupid joke I made. Because... <laughs> uh, my sense of humor is, is a bit... dorky. Okay, so... I was joking about how... I should set up customs at the, uh, at my airport. Because I got the, uh, conveyor belt. And then I decided to actually build customs, so I s it started off as that. And as I was building, I got reminded, oh shit, I do, did you guys hear about when Johnny Depp tried to... Well, he didn't try. He snuck his dogs into Australia. And, um, you know, we... Quarantine and customs is, is very strict here. I mean, we don't have rabies in Australia as a result of that. But that aside, he snuck in his dogs... And at the time, this politician that was in charge of agriculture and stuff, so... He went on TV, and he condemned Johnny Depp for doing that. And he gave Johnny Depp an ultimatum. Take the dogs out of the country, or he would euthanize the dogs. Not personally, but it just came off that way. So it just became this massive thing. <laughs> it's just... This guy goes on national TV. And just, he phrases it in the most Australian way, as well. Like, those dogs need to bugger off back to the US. So, it was this, almost like a death countdown where Do Johnny Depp had to get rid of the dogs. Or they would track him and euthanize him. That was the threat. Now, Johnny Depp did take him out of the country, but, you know. So... It's two things. It's like, Johnny Depp was a bit of an idiot for doing that. And the politician was 100% in the right. But the way he went about telling Johnny Depp to take the dogs out of the country, he just sounded like an idiot. <laughs> just threatening to euthanize the dogs, like, from 0 to 100, you know? So that that's the story. And when I told that story, I was like, wait a minute, I have a toy dog. Can, can you guess what the scene is now? <laughs> That's such a dumb joke. So when people visit my island, they're gonna go out of the airport, and they'll be like, wait, what the hell is this? So you'll either, you'll either understand and make the connection, right, that this is customs and the dog is a big no-no. Or you won't, and you'll, you'll never get the joke, and... You'll just think to yourself, man, this dude has a really nice island. Isn't the camera backwards? Oh yeah, it is too. I 
I did that pretty late at night, so it's fine. Thank you. Oh wow, this guy makes nice builds, but what is this thing at the front of his town, and why the hell is the camera backwards? Alright, well, guess got rid of the end of that sentence. It's just another thing where I had a dumb idea, it made me laugh, and I made said dumb idea. It made, um, news in American talk shows, like John Oliver showed it and he could not stop laughing at just how Australian our politicians sound and just the fact that he just went straight to euthanizing the dogs. I did not well do well this time. Mm. I want to try and beat 13. But also I want to see what items get handed out. Oh, come here. Yeah. Just adds to the, um, the growing list of videos of just crazy old Australian dudes. Like, at some point they just, I don't know, devolve <laughs> into, it's just full on. I hope that doesn't happen to me. I got my fancy table. Yeah. Now at the uh, the happy home thing, I can purchase furniture that I've used to bring back home. So here it is. Like, this is what I wanted. It has an umbrella. You can customize the umbrella, and it's just yeah, it's nice. I want to get a second one. I also bought a slushy maker, so now at the bar there's like a slushy maker downstairs. So, they make fancy ice drinks. Yeah, slushies are good. Oh, I saw, I saw it jump in here. Oh, there it is. Come back. Okay, nine. If you're getting a slushy, what's your go-to flavor? They have this slushy flavor that's like a crushed lemon flavor. It's so good here. Cherry or cherry coke? I haven't tried cherry. Cherry coke is a very seasonal thing here. Like, it's available at least once a year, but it's not a regular item. Uh, 
Oh, that's almost Spider-Man like. That's cool. All the movie theaters have that. Oh, okay, here it's usually um, just normal Coke flavored or raspberry, like the pretty standard too. And then sometimes they have like a bubblegum flavor. But if you go to KFC, they do every beverage as like a slushy. So they do Pepsi, they do Mountain Dew, and they do Solo, which is like the crushed lemon flavor. And then Burger, the equivalent of Burger King here, tries to do like a weird, almost like boba-like experience. That's you have the slushy, but then they add those popping pearls that you usually have in boba. It's not bad. I think just their slushies are kind of weak. But the pearls are good. Like, if I could take a slushy from anywhere else and add those pearls, I'd do it. This is such a clunky menu. <laughs> Routine points. I'll stop once I bubble up a spider web. Okay, I mean, if you want to do a spooky build, sure. A bug aloha shirt. Oh, that's kind of neat. Kind of matches with what I'm wearing. Okay. Hey, wh where'd it go? Nope. Mine. <laughs> I got a round of applause. They're, they're good sports. I'm not. Hand me to win. Mine. No, Alice! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, damn it. Hang on. Hey! Hey! <laughs> What the? What was that? It's okay, it's okay. I appreciate the clown music in the background. Oh man, there's so many here. Okay, get the mantis first. Wait, where'd it go? What? Oh. <laughs> hey! Cut it. Should be worth double for the trouble. Unfortunately, it's not. That was lucky. Those are usually more of a pain. The most expensive bugs are the tarantulas and the scorpions because they actually attack you. Nice. 
Nice. It doesn't look like there's many butterflies around, they're the easier ones to catch. Nice, come on. 13 is my record. Okay, come on, one more, one more. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it. Damn. Ah, yeah, it's, it's luck. Oh. I think there's a multiplayer component to it as well. Like, if someone visits your island, they can take your score. Oops, not that. I mean, I, I doubt I'm not going to come in first. I feel like the villagers are not going to do better than 13. Fifteen points. Wallpaper. Butterflies wall. Okay. No, ugh. What do you mean toy cockroach? I guess this is one of these gag. Oh, that would bother. Oh, you can actually walk over it. I gotta put some of this stuff away. Not that, no. Have I made that? No, I know it. Alright. Uh, what else did I do? Dartboard. And here now there's... Individual stalls. 
So, this looks more appropriate. Give me a sec, I heard like a, a crash. <laughs> I just want to see what it is. In case it's something bad. Give me like 15, 20 seconds. Okay, that's just possums, it's fine. They put the dumpsters out early, and the uh, possums have already gotten into it. It came from outside, but it was loud enough. I think they spilt something, and there must have been glass in it. It just sounded so close. Alright, play around. Okay, this is the one. How about I have the net out? This might not be the one. <laughs> I haven't found anything yet. Oh, come on, really? No, no bugs? Oh, this is... This is some shit. First minute's practically gone. Nope. Already- oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I missed. I slightly missed. It's okay, they only get upset if you hit them multiple times. <sighs> Alright, this, this is not the one. Did I see something here? No? Yeah, I jinxed myself. Hey! Where'd it go? Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Two. Yeah, that one's in the river. I can't get it. <laughs> I have to get at least three. Come on. Not great. Cool. 
cool. That reminds me, I need to do the money tree. Not great. I wonder what this lizard does with the bugs. Um, something else? Oh. Guess I have to do one more. Alright, one more. One more. I'm not saying anything. Is that one in the background? Yep. There's one in the background. Okay. This is all luck. Just gotta hope that enough appear in the vicinity. Okay, good. Oh, there's one. Surprised I saw that one. No, come on. There we go. Just has to be nice to me. Ugh, I probably won't make it. Unless I get like three or four right away. Ah, uh, oh crap, there was one there. I should have walked. Someone that gets scared if you run.
Ah, I mean, it's still good. Just... It's very hard to beat 13. Thanks for- oh, I'll send your prize in the mail. Oh, I got a prize because I've gotten 100 total points. Okay. Those dogs were not worth a lot. Alright. Nope. I see another one in the background, alright, that's good. Gentle with this one. I like bugs that are like that. There's one that looks like a leaf that's pretty crazy. This might have worked out if I'd gotten that one. No, I missed. Damn, this could have been the run. If I had gotten those two, I'd be up to 13. There's still time. Come on. I think I'm gonna get 13. <sighs> I would have had... I would have had it. 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 <laughs> For fuck's sake. Okay. Yep, great. And the net explodes. Alright. So. 13. Again. Had I not missed, that would have been 15. So it's, it's doable. It's just... Gotta be on point. It's keeping me mildly entertained.
Yeah, I'm getting it. This is this is the one. A strike one day, just catching butterflies. I uh, just, I just feel it. Full tilt. I saw a butterfly. Would it go there? Hey! Oh, oh this is embarrassing. <laughs> Hello, blue pushy hawk. Welcome. Ah, oh, man. I don't think. Yeah, this one's not going anywhere. It's, it's already been a minute, and I only have two. Please let me get three. Alright, there we go. I've gotten quite a few the last minute, but not enough to beat my record. Last minute of this was such a waste. Okay, let's just leave it. I'll redeem and see what else I can get out of this. Oh wow, okay. Wait, but that's a bag. A bug cage bag? Toy centipede. Okay. Ladybug rug. Okay. 
a bug wand. I haven't made a wand yet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if I can be bothered making outfits to register. Alright, come on. This is at 15 this time. One. Alright, good. Good start. Two. Oh, this is going well. That's good. Okay, this is an amazing start. This is the one. Yes, there's already another one over there. I'm already up to seven and it's only the first minute. Let's go! <laughs> Come on! I'm going to be very upset if I don't get it. This is mine to lose. One more. Yes! <laughs> Alright. Got it. Not that I get anything for it, this is just personal satisfaction. No, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. 16. I can settle for that. Okay, hold on. My head, my headset that entire time was beeping like, "Hey, change your batteries! Hey, change your batteries!" It's not actually saying that, but it may as well be. It's annoying. It gets to ten percent battery and then it beeps every two seconds, even though there's ten percent battery left. All right, I plugged it in. I don't think I can do much better than that. Okay, let's redeem. Alright, 
I'm getting duplicates now, so I guess we're done. Yeah, alright. We're done. That's everything. I don't have to keep going. I've gotten every item. I think the wand was the last item. Wait, hold on. I forgot to check something. I'm gonna go to the Happy Home Island thing. But first, I wanna just double check. Okay. I don't have to buy the music today. So then... another blue one. Okay. Oh, I haven't watered the flower. Uh, <laughs> okay, I, I guess I should do this quickly. I was kind of hoping it would rain, to be honest. I also wanted to play a bit of Risk of Rain, but I just want to check the uh, the stock at the island first. I unlocked a character that I haven't played in a while, so I do want to try it. I just need it to be in a mood where I feel it's okay for a game to kick my ass repeatedly. Risk of Rain is fun. Well, Risk of Rain returns. But it is fun. Just one is a lot harder. <laughs> Last time I unlocked the character that I hope one day gets added to two, it's the chef character.
But also, I've been meaning to test if I can do 4K properly. Well, put Twitch at like the highest quality possible and then record at 4K and see if the computer's okay with it. It should be, but. I wanna stress test it. That one, I can't tell. No. What? How did it miss? Hear a balloon. There it is. Table. Oh, I got a Christmas tree. It is December, but in-game I only put that stuff up in the last week. orange flowers am I gonna need before it spits out a purple one, honestly. Nearly done. 
just whatever's here and the white roses. everything. Let me just check. Yep. Okay, that's done. Oh, hold on. Someone's going to be crafting something. Oh, you're not crafting. What are you doing? It's great to work out indoors. I find it much easier to focus. I just got called tedious by Sasha. He said I only ever think about muscles. But that's not tedious. I mean, just look at how many muscle groups you can work on. Or all the perfect, or all the routines you can create and perfect. <laughs> I would say if you have like a very elaborate workout routine, it, it would be tedious. Oops. anything. What? <laughs> she wants me to wear a racing helmet with... because it would go... Apparently that would go with my outfit, that's what was said. So wait, which villager is crafting something? Whose house haven't I visited? They're all out and about. Yeah. It might be Sasha. No, it's not Sasha either. Uh, uh, okay. No one's crafting?
guess not. Hmm. Alright. Can't say I didn't try. I'm not going to do the happy home thing, but I'll check what items are available today. And you also get a free cooking recipe. to teach you the recipes in the school's coffee room seems a perfect place for that. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? Welcome, class. My name is Mr. Nico. I've always wanted to say that. You can still call me Nico. Good one, Mr. Nico. So for today's lesson, I'll teach you the recipes for pillars and island counters. I guess I should start explaining what those are. But- oh! First, the pillar by itself can deeply affect a room with its solemn presence and gravity. But you can also connect it with partition walls. You can do amazing things. Look at those right angles. Island count- oh, that's cool. Just like with the partition wall, you can use it to divide a room. But unlike a partition wall, it's short, so you can divide a room, but keep it feeling a little more open. That's pretty neat. Since island counters come in two heights, you can have lots of options to experiment with different looks. Okay. Right angle. That's nice. I guess it's more options for when I do build stuff. Ah, Eric is here. I like this this villager. Damn. Oh, the choices are actually good today. <laughs> look at look at the soup he's having. Who's this? Lily. <laughs> trying not to. Sorry. Disregard it. Just pretend nothing's going on here. Plain scones. I'm moving away. I'm moving away. It's, it's Eric. There's actually some good choices. 
I'm, I'm not feeling too creative today. <laughs> so. I don't think I do a good job. Pot, classroom TV. Well, it's a karaoke system. I thought it was like a classroom. It's actually a karaoke system. I just noticed the microphones. That's nice, but there's no way I can afford that. Even if I do a build, the build's only get going to get me twelve thousand. That's disappointing. This I might buy, because this is actually a kitchen counter. And I can put it inside the restaurant kitchen. A soup pot. Eh, everything else is fine. Oh yeah, there should be a recipe washed up on the beach somewhere. I liked what I did here. I got the chocolate flooring. Woven vines hat? Oh, that's what it looks like. Okay. Wait, that means I can use those half walls and stuff inside the house. Hmm. Well, that's a fancy chicken. Becky. Never seen this villager before. Found the money rock, found the furniture. I guess the only thing I should do is the daily island, because that's just subsidized. Alright, let's go, cat hunt. I'll only do something on the island if it's interesting, otherwise I'll just collect the recipe and leave. What on earth is going on outside? I think there are a bunch of people with... <laughs> just... I don't know if they're doing like one of those meetups, car meetups, but it's just it's loud outside. Pressing multiple buttons. Yeah, 
Doesn't look fancy. Just. I mean, okay, that's just materials. I may as well, because I've been crafting quite a bit with that. There's probably a money rock as well. Let's just try and find it. Ah, oh, it skipped one. Damn. I thought it would place it on top of the the crack. Hey. I think there's one more rock left. There's no money rock. Alright, well. Guess this was in a this was a special island in the sense that I got vines and stuff, but I haven't seen one of the, the super special ones. The ones that take place in a whole different season and you get star fragments from the rocks. I just haven't seen one. I mean, I guess I may as well... hold on. I may as well do this. I kind of miss what he did in the previous game. 
you had more varied activities. Like, you had scavenger hunts, you had... ...things that you had to hunt for specifically. Mazes. And his whole family was with him as well. He has a little... ...photo. The songs are so odd. Yeah, they need to be odd on purpose. Have you been here when I talk to the stoner otter? The stoner otter is also strange. Don't think so. Okay, let me rectify that. I love the stoner otter, but I've gotten all the recipes I think from him, that's why I haven't really bothered with it. But he's also a daily occurrence. His name is Pascal, but I call him the stoner otter. You'll see why. hear the sneeze noise. <laughs> I mean, it's the closest description to what it is. I don't know what the intended... the inten intended effect is supposed to be. But I don't know, I see it as like it's a hype man saying something. Just whether it's your Little John or Fat Man Scoop. Or DJ Khaled. Just someone that got famous by saying three words. At most. Hopefully this won't take long. I tried to think of it as a hype man thing, but every time you hear it, it just sounds like a sneeze. <laughs> So the person playing the music just cuts it off completely, just so then he can sneeze. That just draws more attention to it. What if it's like the Macarena? You know how it goes, Hey Macarena! Ah! <laughs> what if it's just that? That's a, that's a deep cut. That's certainly gonna out how old I am. Ooh, a pearl. Maybe. 
make the connection. Turn 40 next week. <laughs> I'm headed for 36. So I'm into my mid my mid 30s now. Wait, do you have a Christmas birthday? Or oh, that's on. You would have a birthday where like people double up with Christmas, and they're like, "Happy birthday and Christmas." Yeah, that's unfortunate. My dad's actually on Christmas Day. Need to find a scallop, and you will see the stone altar. Just my luck. Every time I start looking for something, it just disappears from the face of the earth. No SpongeBob? I don't think so. There's the pineapple. There's a starfish. There's a squid. There's no squirrel. Plenty of crabs. room do I have left? Alright, there's still, there's still time. Oh, that's a new crab. Gazami crab. Okay, I have to donate that to the museum. We can learn about it. Typical. Usually I, I get the, the scallop right away. And today, the one time I want to show off the stone order, it's like, nah, no scallops here.
There it is. Hey, man. About that scallop of yours, can I have it? Sure. Oh, thanks for your generosity, man. Since you were cool, I left you something you'll dig. While I'm at it, let me lay some truth on you, the deep kind. Feel this. Castles are just like houses that are wearing armor, man. Consider yourself truth. Yep, today is a good day. So that's Stone Otter. Daily words of wisdom. They've written so many more lines for that. I, I still haven't gotten to the point where they're repeating. It's just a lot of shower thoughts, you know? Someone wrote all of them. Well, it wasn't for nothing. I got to show it and... I did get a new critter to donate. Yeah, what did he leave me? A pearl. Okay, yeah, I figured. The only other game I've seen where they've done a lot of dialogue to the point where I've seen a lot of it and it still hasn't repeated is Hades. Like, that game is great. The story is not only good, but just the amount of dialogue they have. The Kazami Crab may be better known by its more descriptive name, the Japanese Blue Crab. It gets its name from the blue tint sometimes found on its shell and legs. Its paddle-like rear legs are what help it swim freely and quickly through the water. Of course, this Kazami Crab couldn't swim quickly enough to get away from you. Uh, nothing too strange. Um, do I want that? I guess there's another way to play music. I don't want any of this stuff. Okay. Uh, one last thing. I don't think I've gotten the recipe that's washed up on the beach. Maybe. Okay, another gyroid.
Oh dear. Ah. Okay, maybe I have. Well, I got a gyro for it. Alright, cool. No happy home today. I'm not feeling creative. Ugh, old man stretch. <sighs> okay, well, uh, yeah, tomorrow is turn up day, so I'll probably have to wake up for that one. I guess I can get some breakfast and then do that. But it'll be the last time I do turnips. I should be set for money after that point. Alright, well, uh, yeah, that's it for Animal Crossing. If you are checking this out later on YouTube, thanks for watching as well. Um, and, you know the drill, if you want to support the channel over there, just clickety-click buttons like the like button. It helps a lot, so appreciate it if you do do that. Or... Assuming I remember to do it, uh, just click videos that pop up on your screen if you want to watch me play something else. But yeah, see you next time.